Hi everyone, can you tell that maybe one of us has been shopping at Shane again? Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to see you guys. Today we're just going to do a little informal vlog, coffee, tea, wine, and life. So anyway, as I'm getting ready for the day, I thought I would stop. I was almost done with my makeup and I said, you know, I have had this PR from iMethod Beauty, The Perfect Wings. Actually, I had it for a few weeks. I actually... It's a little star behind it. But anyway, so I got up to the point of doing my highlighter and I said, you know what? I'm going to do this on camera as my PR. Got my coffee. Then accidentally it was so good I drank almost all of it. So anyway, welcome to coffee, tea, wine, and life. Very unscripted, very casual little chit chat with you. So cheers, everyone. Hope everyone is having a great weekend. This is so, so good. So I got my Bones coffee cup. I have got my Bones a coffee that I'm drinking today. Actually, like my third cup uh, of the day. So I've got uh, the Bones coffee, the salted caramel. So, so good. And I got some of this Starbucks, the Camel Macchiato. I actually made this as like a frozen drink the other day. I had some of this with just some coffee creamer, a little bit of added milk just to kind of make it a little less, and some ice, put it through my blender, and it was amazing. But right now I'm using this as my coffee creamer. So good. So anyway, I hope that everyone is having a fantastic day. I have got on that nightgown again because I was getting ready for the day and how I got that kind of like a kind of lilac -y one, lavender one, and then because it did wash and wear well, I got the same one in black and then this is kind of like the chambray blue. It's got the little lace, um, crochet lace straps. Just put it on with my Shane blazer and I'm like feeling good to go someplace, but I'm not going anyplace. But anyway, I was putting on my makeup. And I got this a few weeks ago, so I have got to reach out to Alex and apologize profusely. And yeah, I wish I could figure out which way my bangs were going. But anyway, they reached out again to me at um, iMethod Beauty, and they sent me another one of those wing kits for the perfect wings for your eyeliner stamp. And because I do work from home, and I got so excited when I saw that the um, mailman dropped it off, and I was working on some paperwork, and then my boss called and said he was going to stop over for a little bit. Do I have any paperwork? I want to send them back to the office. So I'm like, okay. I thought I lost it. I put it in my paperwork to go back to the office. Yeah, so it's been sitting on my desk waiting for me to come back and get it. I haven't made it back to the office yet. So the last week when my boss came back in to drop off some more paperwork for me and pick up some paperwork, he dropped off my perfect wings so yeah so we're going to do that today before I lose it again so this one and I have done the brows for them I've done the um, the plump lip plumping that is so so nice feeling I've done the other eyeliner kit that is really really nice this one's a little bit different so you do get two things again so this one you get the stamps and so it tells you which one is right and left so that is in that same one and then you get the eyeliner right here and it's like that cold liquid liner so there's and I'm probably going to mess it up there is a I think that might be the thick one and then a thinner, side, a thinner one so that if you wanted to do a thick line or a thinner line it gives you that option to do that so anyway, like I said, I was getting ready for the day and I knew I wanted to kind of step in and do a vlog because one of us accidentally went to Shane again and I thought, you know what, I'm going to do this. So let's finish up my eyes. So this is the right one and I don't have my makeup mirror here. I just got a little thing here on my desk. So let's try to do this. So, so this will be for the right one. And so you got that stamp. And the other one was so easy. And you know how sometimes you can kind of psych yourself out too. Like I'm thinking, is this one different? Am I going to make a mess? Am I going to embarrass myself? Because other people have been doing such a great job. 
So anyway, you just kind of stamp it right there. And I lost my cap. Oh, I did. It's right here. So anyway, let's do the other one. Make sure I do the right side here. And again, this will be for the left side. I think I want to do that. And... And I always have one side that comes out a little bit better than the other one. I don't know if there's a secret to it, but one always seems to be more horizontal, and then the other one seems to have the great angle. But anyway, that's what that looks like right now. And I'm not sure which side I'm going to pick off, but I will use whichever one comes off first. So I got this, the eyeliner right here. And so you just kind of want to pick up that line right there. And I think that came out okay. And I don't have um, mascara on yet, so that'll give it a more finished look as well. Alrighty, so that's what that looks like. I am going to go check out on the big mirror with the lights, see how that came out, put my mascara on, and then I'll be right back and we'll talk a little bit more about the eye method eyeliner stamp. Alrighty, so I'm back. I put my mascara on. I disconnected the eyeliner a little bit more on the big makeup mirror with the lights, but I think that you can see how easy it was to do and anyone who knows me knows hashtag Nancy has no idea when it comes to skincare and makeup. I kind of psych myself out sometimes because I watched other people do their, their videos and they're all so good. They all know what they're doing. They, some of them, quite a few of them can do the winged eyeliner without using a stamp. So I kind of like psych myself out like I'm not good enough. I can't do this. And as you can see how easy it was to do, just in a little compact mirror here, I was able to, to do this look. And again, it's just really, really easy. So thank you so much, Alex, for your patience and for sending this to me. I appreciate it so much. So again, this is Eye Method, Perfect Wings, Eyeliner, Stampin' Pencil. It's a two-piece kit. You're going to get the stamp that comes in this little pink one. And off to the side, it's going to tell you if it's right or the left side, so you know which eye to put it on. You're going to get the eyeliner, the liquid eyeliner, like that cold kind of liner. Uh, one's going to be a fine line. One's going to be um, a little bit thicker line. So if you want to do a thicker line, you can. If you want to kind of keep it nice and slim, you can do that as well. Again, just, I mean, I psych myself out, but... I think I did okay with it and it just makes it so much fun for those of us that aren't comfortable with makeup that really don't know what we're doing with it or how to achieve that wing look but you see so many people that have it and you want it and you know you can't do it this makes it possible and again so this one um iMethod Beauty does have their own website where they have all their array of products that are on there. They have all kinds of tutorials on their site, explain a little bit more about it. Um, I think I've seen some of their products on Walmart's website and of course on Amazon. So right now this is $13.97 on Amazon. If you have Prime, uh, Prime membership, you're going to get free shipping on that. So it's just really, really fun. I enjoy doing this so much because, yeah, I can't do this. Um, so thank you, Alex. Thank you, iMethod Beauty. I really appreciate this opportunity to try your products. And it's just a lot of fun. I mean, I, the lip plumping is really fun. The other eyeliner that I've got, the eyebrow pet stamp, really fun. But anyway, moving on with my vlog. So Ali Bao. So a couple of weeks ago, she had sent me some friend mail. And it was a really cute kitchen towel. Wine a little, laugh a lot. Because I've got that little plaque that I've got that on there too. And so she sent that along with some face mask and some fun things like that. And then she realized she forgot to put the card and she pulled a Nancy. Yeah, that's what we call it when we forget to do things like that. Sometimes we call it a senior moment. Sometimes I call it, you pulled a Nancy. But anyway, Allie Bo, she is so, so sweet. She's up in Washington. 
she's got a youtube channel as well i'll link her below she has got such a soft spoken voice now i'm kind of nasally it's really embarrassing everybody knows who i am when i mean i call vendors all over the place and talk to so many different vendors and they all know who i am it's so embarrassing and i feel like they're saying oh yeah you're the only one that has that nasally voice so i know exactly who you are nancy yeah i try to disguise my voice sometimes it doesn't work but anyway Ali Bo, she, she is amazing, and so she sent that friend mail, and then right after she sent it, she realized she forgot to put the card in it, so she sent that card to me. The card is so pretty, so we've got like blue and teal and green and purple scallop shells. I miss fresh scallops wrapped in bacon, baked in the oven. Great appetizer. Of course, bacon makes everything taste good, but I love scallops too. They're nice, especially when they're fresh. They're awesome. So anyway, P.S. Oops. I forgot to include this in the package, so I mailed it. And then, hi, Nancy. When I saw the kitchen towel, I immediately thought of you. I decided to add a couple of my favorite sheet masks and more. Allie Bow. So, again, I'll leave her link below. I hope that you check her out. She is amazing. She's really, really sweet. All right. So, as you can tell, I went to Shane well shane.com and of course i got these uh, a couple of weeks ago i got this a couple of weeks ago i got these a couple of weeks ago blazers from shane my 90s from shane but you know this is new so this i don't know if you can see the details because it's kind of just kind of all whited out for me but it's a nice headband it's got lots of faux pearls on it it's raised up it looks really fun they have got so many different headbands i even have fascinators and things like that so this was only eight dollars i know amazing so i spent i think i got like 10 different things and i spent 36 dollars. prices are crazy so i just want to show you what i got in the shane haul so first thing that i got and it's kind of hard because i want to keep my prices out where i can see them was um so i got a couple more rings this one was $2.50. So again, it's going to be like some rhinestones and some faux pearls. This one wasn't adjustable, but you can see it right there. Um, I think it'll fit on this finger as well. If you wanted to put it on a different finger which is really nice for $2.50. All kinds of little tiny rhinestones and the pearls. It's just a little bit of bling. You know, Nancy loves her bling. Alrighty, so next I got, and I messed up my sequence here. I don't know how I do that, but I got two, two, two different earrings. They were both $2. And one's going to be in black, and the other one's kind of like crystal. They're like the chandelier type earrings. Again, these were $2. Just some faceted like plastic. I think they're going to be a nice sometimes when I wear black. Got the same set and I've already worn these so they're off the thing and these ones are more like white with some crystals. And just a really nice fun length. Again these were two dollars each. Next we got this other ring which is really really cool let me see if i can get this one off now it's like a two-parter it's a two-piece ring so i mean i've worn this a couple of different ways so I put it on my index finger it's so much easier to do when you're not trying to do it on camera but so i got one on my thumb and then it's hooked to a chain. This one, it's not adjustable. This one fits nice. This is loose, but I suppose they kind of do that so that you still have your movement. And this one was only, I mixed up my thing again. This one was $2.50. And if I wanted to, I could also put that one on my middle finger and then have that ring there, so. Again, just a real pretty ring and next I've got a couple of these this one's a little bit different but this one was a dollar fifty so I got the one that's like the pink hot pink rose and one that's like kind of purpley rose this one's got a butterfly and again the you know just that resin 
and some little rhinestones and this one is adjustable right there so you can pull it apart to make it a little bigger and put it on that's what it looks like for $1.50 not bad this was eight dollars next we got a three-piece set I'll show you the earrings first so this was only four dollars and fifty cents and again I mean it's costume jewelry it's it, I'm sure it's not made to last but just a little bit of fun while it's here so we got these blue gems it's kind of like that cobalt blue that I really like so be a nice little pop of color right there and then the necklace that goes with it it's a large necklace it's a statement necklace with lots of bling so look at that it goes really nice with these pajamas I think this is going to be fun with my cobalt blue hat and just my wine diary dresses so again we got these blue gems I have no idea why this does not want to focus too much and then these little rhinestones just just a fun little piece to have you know fun with for playing dress up and some of the uh, the rhinestones uh, did come off in mailing but they I just got some glue and glued it back on with my glue gun so again for this for four dollars and fifty cents just a, a really fun piece next we got another three-piece necklace set so if I can find the earrings that I buried in here here's one so this is what the and this one was three dollars and fifty cents so that's what the earrings look like so again just a little pop of color a little bit of bling I have no idea why my hair does not want to behave and then why do you see this necklace I hope this focuses so it's got like the uh, filigree I've got a rose that's kind of sparkles and again just a just a fun piece for three dollars and fifty cents you know if you get a few uses out of it and get to have some fun for a few videos I think it's fun I think it's worth it yeah I'm I have no idea how this happened but I got hooked on Shane in their costume jewelry but it's just a lot of fun so I think that's everything that I got right oh got these ones right here in front of me so anyway I just wanted some fun bright earrings and I got uh, you know I got my pink derby hat and I got some pink dresses and so I thought these would be fun and these, these are pretty big these were actually more expensive than some of the other other ones these ones were six dollars so again it's like a nice fuchsia pink with all this kind of layering but I thought that would be really fun and then I wanted something that was kind of corally I couldn't find one this is called light pink but I'm hoping that it'll be light enough to go with something coral and this one's for three dollars and fifty cents so again it's like that material here it just kind of looks like some flowers a little bit of fun a little bit of color and that was it so all those items for $36 from Shane so I have got another Miss Ellie to show you I think this is the last one that I have to show you and then I should be on board for getting them every month so Miss Ellie again this one was called something coral coral cutie and I'm not exactly sure why I bought it because it kind of washes me off this color and sometimes the lighter shades kind of show lumps and bumps and not attractive but we'll see how it looks I just really fell in love with the color and that's what I was hoping these would go with so anyway these pants and of course you know they're not cheap I mean the quality is there so this is uh, the color of the slacks the uh, leggings we got this back zippered pocket right here along the waistband we have got these side pockets that I really love for, you know, maybe your emergency Kleenex when you're out of the house or your phone or a credit card, your ID, something like that. If something happens, um, and I'm pretty sure that these ones are full length leggings in the back. Just really, they are like 
buttery, buttery soft. I sewed the tank top. It's that corally shade. And it doesn't look like it's going to be like skin tight. It looks like it's going to be flowy, so something comfortable, especially for the summer. Looks like it is a little bit of a high-low and a little slit right there. And the sports bra, again, is that corally color. It's got these small straps, though, but they are adjustable. So nice coverage and then like a little tea back. So let's see if we can do a little try on before my camera shuts off again. Alrighty. So I will be right back. Alrighty. So I'm back and I got on those earrings. So I think that's a light enough pinky peach so that it kind of does kind of go with this light coral set. Again, um, it, does, it, it has a nice fit. It's not tight at all, so it's going to be nice and comfortable for this time of year. It is full length leggings, and it is a nice, whoops, corally shade. And it does have a little split, a little bit lower in the back. We have got side pockets. I have to get my rings in there, but it's nice and deep. It goes almost down to my knee, so it'll fit. Anything you want to probably fit in there. If you have a iPhone or maybe your keys, if you've got your car and you went someplace that you could go walking on a path or something. But again, just a fun outfit. I know I'm probably running out of time here. I'm going to leave information on Miss Ellie below. I love this set. Um, they are just so comfortable and I can't wait to really be able to get out, do some walking and exercise again. But in the meantime, I just love being comfortable and having a little bit of a length. So thank you guys so much for stopping and spending a little bit of your day with me. It means more to me than I can ever let you know. So thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart. We'll see you again soon. Love you guys. Take care. Stay safe. Be kind. Have fun. Enjoy life. Bye-bye.